Hello dear students, welcome to Exeomaticos. This video is the part of the solution series for IIT JAM 2008. So we are here with this problem 5 of your paper. So let us firstly have a look on this problem what it says. It says the set of all boundary points of Q in R is so what question is asking? Question is asking us about the boundary points of a set Q. What is Q here? Q is the set of rational. R, R minus Q, Q and empty set. So these are your options, right? So firstly what we need to define, we need to define boundary points for a set, okay? And only after that we can, uh, we can figure out this question. So let me show you the definition for this. So this is the definition what we are going to look at we are going to look at just only the first definition okay so we have three equivalent definitions for the boundary uh, boundary points of a subset s of a topological space so let us firstly see this thing so what it says the closure of s minus the interior of s so what uh, what we have we have the boundary points okay the definition for the boundary point and according to the definition boundary point is actually the closure of s minus the interior of s that is okay it is represented by del s so del s actually represent the boundary points so it is equal to s closure minus s interior so you got my point i am not going to read these remaining definitions they are all also equivalent so what we have to use, we have to use the first one, okay. We can use any of them, but the first one is little bit easy. So what we have according to the definition, okay, let me change my pen, okay, it's not white. So wait. Okay, so we have to find out the boundary points for Q. So boundary point is denoted by del of Q, okay. This represent the boundary points of Q and according to the definition, it's equal to Q closer minus Q interior, okay. Now if you, if you know little bit analysis about the set rational, what you know is that closer of Q is actually Q union Q derived set. Are you getting my point or not? So Q derived means actually it contains all the limit points. Now this is Q interior. Now what do you know about Q dash? Q dash limit points of rational. You know the whole R are the limit points of the rational. So you will get Q union R. Are you getting my point? So now since R is a superset of Q, therefore this union will be itself R. Now you know that Q can, uh, Q have no interior points that you already know, okay? So I'm not going to explain that thing that why Q interior is empty. So it's empty, okay? So Q interior is empty. So now this will equal to R itself. So what you finally concluded that R is the set of uh, is the set of boundary points for Q. So you got my point. So what things we have used? We have used that Q dash is equal to R. Another thing is Q interior is also empty. Are you getting my point? So if you don't know how this thing is concluded, you can look at your analysis book and then try to see why this thing is happening, okay? I am directly using these. So therefore, A option is a correct option, B is incorrect, C is also incorrect and D is also incorrect. So the only correct option is A. So this is how we should proceed in exam. So what, uh, if, you, if you know these basic definitions, you can finish this question in in just a minute okay we don't take uh, it is this question is not going to take much time there so thank you